Hi there, it's Murray McMillan, Blackboard Support. And in this screencast, what we're going to be talking about is Blackboard Groups. And I think the first thing I need to do is to clarify what a, black, what a, a group is. Now, it may seem self-explanatory, and it is a Blackboard Group. It's just simply that, a group of students and or instructors or anybody with any role can belong to a, a group in Blackboard. But the important thing about the group is that you can use it to organize your course. You can organize your grade center to a specific group, meaning if you only want to see the members of that group in a specific grade center view, you can do that. If you want to allocate a specific piece of learning and your learning resources to a specific group, you can do that also. If you want a discussion board to relate to that specific group, again, you can do that as well. First thing I need to show you is how we're going to add a group. So we go into the module. Now you'll notice in this module that my edit mode is off and my control panel is collapsed. So what I want to do is I need to do a bit of user management. I'm not going to find that in the content areas and I'm not going to find it in the tools area either. What I need to do is I need to go to the control panel. I need to go to users and groups. And I need to find groups. And what we're going to do is switch on our edit mode. And we've got two options here. We've got create single group and we've got create group set. Now, create single group, self-explanatory, you can create one group. Create group set means that you are given an option on how many groups you want to create and the criteria that you're going to use to create that group set. Because this is quite different from the way that things were done in Blackboard 8, I'm going to make this a series of screencasts. Uh, the, ne the next screencast will be on self-enrollment and manual enrollment for single groups and then we'll move on to creating group sets. So thank you for listening and look forward to speaking to you in the next screencast.